Welcome to Coastal Fishing TV. Today we're at the Twansy Channel, um, chasing the squid on Twitchy. We've hooked up now. We've hooked up now and... Oh, really two squid. Two, two squid. squid. One, oh, oh, nice one too. Right, we're out here below and I'm over to the next one. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, We've been here for just a bit over half an hour. We've got we got two of the first drift, then we're just drifting here. We haven't got touched, and then here you go. this rod just bent. This rod just bent, and we've hooked ourselves two squid. And the reason the reason why we've got two squid is because they usually travel in groups, and these two have just seen the jig, and then just yeah, one has probably hooked up, and then the others probably just so nice, nice arrow squid there. Nice arrow two. squid. Two arrow squid. So we're just gonna chuck them in the live well. And the way, if you want to actually kill them straight away, you can just stick your finger under there, under there, and then you just pull it out, and it yeah, should turn white. It turns white, and that's good. So, so yeah. is it two fish and um, kingfish lollies? Yeah, we're just gonna use these for like liveies or something. These are a bit big, but they still kingies will still be big. Fish. And I was just fishing at this um. trying to catch a brim or something and then I pulled up and I thought it was like weed or something a big chunk of weed and it's this big flatty it's a big flatty and we're getting out I don't know how I did it it's like just the idea just the idea just the idea oh that's a nice female I don't know how I did it I'll just be flicking the Z-Man two and a half inch grubs in Violet Sparkle, just flicking that around, and I got this big. Uh, I felt um, just felt like something just a uh, weed on. Then I feel bumps, and I'm like, what? I'm on. And then I saw it, and it was a big flatty, nice flatty. So I'm onto a squid here. He's wound it up quickly, he dropped his down, and he hit, and it, and he hit it, and he's on. Right, so put him in the live bait. That's how many squid? Six. That's six squid we've caught so far. So it pays off, we're at the Swansea Channel. And the rig we're using, we're using a dropper rig thing. And we got a dropper with a squid jig on, another dropper with another squid jig on. Just like these ones, not the one with weight on sinker at the bottom. So we've just got this squid. One tentacle. See look, one tentacle. And that body is actually pretty hooked pretty well on that one tentacle. But they can snap it off pretty easy. Just a little kingfish lolly. They're really good for kingfish. And it was on a blue Yozuri jig. Oh, so we've just got this squid. 
TT one quarter. Jig head. I'm trying to keep his head in the water. Maybe. Quite a nice float, isn't it? So a nice 46 dusty. 46 centimetres dusty. On the four inch um, Kelly Tails in motor oil. And a TT one quarter jig head. Whatever that is. I've got to swim him heaps because he's really tired. Because he had him out of the water for a bit, quite a while. Okay. Yeah, but. So just put your thumb in his mouth. There he is. So we just caught this flatty and it's a totally different species. No, bring it in the boat, bring it in the boat. Same spot, pretty much let just, go, let go. just a little, just a little bit down, a little more of a drift down for where I got mine. And totally you've species. just got this totally different species. I've got tail colour on the Z-Man, four inch minnows in um no four inch not four inch curly minnows tails, yeah. four inch curly tails in um what do you call it motor oil. Motor oil. rigged on a tt one quarter ounce jig head and i don't know any sense never well, caught these but they look totally different oh, look at that color so, so i've just caught this flatty we're not sure what type it is but we, we think it might be a marble flatted or a banded flatted or something and i'll just release it caught it in Lake Macquarie. We usually catch marble flatted in the ocean. But beautiful colours and patterns on it. Are you ready? Just a little tacker. Bite him down and off it goes. So we're on to this nice fish on the fly squid. Here's the leader. Oh, oh, nice king too. Nice king. He's right. Old guy. Yes. Whoa. Nice king on the that. circle. <laughs> yes. yes. Hold him up. Show him. Yes. Nice. Yep. Right, beauty. Alright, so one for this fish, he's got a lot of weight. It's just a nice flatty. And now I'm gonna I'll lead I'll lead him to the net. French minnows in bad chat and a TT one eighth G head, I think. Or oh, no, headlock. Headlock. Headlock? No, headlock or... no. no. The one eighth yeah. TT. Oh yeah, it's a one eighth TT G head. Is that headlock? I think it might, yeah it is, oh, yeah, it is. Head the new headlocks jig head. New headlocks jig heads and he's biting on that pack. So ready, these headlock jig heads have really um strong hooks, mustard hooks, and they're really strong. You can see they're really strong and um that bad chad, Z-Man French minnows in bad chad. They're a good lure. This fish had a lot of weight, but it's not that big. Is a 44. 44 centimeters on the Swivel's original fish measure. Everyone needs one of these, they're the best measure yeah. in the business. They're pretty much essential for You like need them. Tell? Alright. So I'll just lift him up for you. No, these are pretty much the perfect eating size. Perfect eating size, 43, from 40 centimeters to 50. Five centimeters is the best eating size. But you we get, let anything. We let we let we, our fish go. We anyway. let like heaps of our fish go. We're just keeping a few today for dinner you because know, we want to have a nice dinner. You know. So you lead him. I'll put him in the live well. And these Z-Mans and TTs have paid off today. Yeah, the Z-Mans and TTs have yeah, paid off of today. This, uh, we're in some the disease sense. CLF has been working today. So yes. Callum's just took yeah, this. Yeah, I'm hooked up. Just after Jack's fizz. Just after last oh, fish. I caught heavy, my last really lady. heavy. Oh, on the yeah, four inch Z Man Kelly Tails in Matarail on a TT yeah, it's a one quarter. It's a nice flatty, like the last. Ooh, it looks like he's gonna jump. Yeah. It's a nice flatty. Just turn his head around and pull it. Just go nice and fast. Yeah, nice and fast. 
I love fish like this. That is a four pound. Yeah. No, six pounds. Six pound oh, salt. six pound leader. Two better. I'll just make. So, what he does, if Izzy takes the fish's head out of the water, you actually lose. So he, well, well, he, oh, it's he, he, more chance because it's. More of a chance of. They go a bit more skits here. They go psycho. But, oh, oh. no. And there we you go. actually lead the fish to the net. Yeah. So, the, yeah, the best way that, is put the head on the water. Oh, I'll give you the camera. Oh, I'll give you the camera. 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 I'll yeah, it's 51. 51. Yep. Oh, what a guess. Oh, yeah. Good guesses. Put some in their mouth like this, and then put their mouth open, and just do this. Okay? That girl is. She is. And you can stick their head out of the water, and that. Because they make them, like, not happy. There she, there she yeah? goes. Oh, she goes. Look at her. It's actually a bit wobbly. That's awesome. Yeah. I'm not sure if you know, but we're at Lake Macquarie. And we've got fresh squid, and I've just landed a nice chewy. I'm so happy <laughs> right now. I'm so happy. I just landed this beautiful chewy. 